In this video, I'm showing you how to use PancakeSwap with Trust Wallet. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and hit that subscribe button and also leave a like as well. I really do appreciate it. Now, I know there's been a big update to Apple devices where the browser from within Trust Wallet has now been removed. Within this tutorial, I'm showing you an updated method of being able to connect Trust Wallet and PancakeSwap so you continue uh, trading tokens. So without any further ado, let's go and get into this. So guys, as you can see, I'm now on my phone and let's go and get straight into this tutorial. So here is Trust Wallet. All you want to do is simply open it up. And here we go. So as you can see, Apple have now released this update where we don't have the browser and it's going to be really annoying when trying to buy and sell altcoins or just other coins as well. Uh, you've got this DEX here as well, um, but this has only got sort of more general coins. But there is a really easy workaround for this and I'll be explaining it fully in this video. So let's go and get straight into this. So all you need to do is simply come off of Trust Wallet and then you want to simply go and open up your browser. So here we go, I'm now my browser and all you want to do is simply go to PancakeSwap. So simply search PancakeSwap. Now do keep watching as well uh, because I'm showing you the full guide and there's a few sort of things you do need to know so do keep watching. So then you want to make sure you come to the official PancakeSwap site which is PancakeSwap.finance so click there. It's going to take you here um, to the farms and staking section. You want to come to the top left and click on to the three lines and then go and click on trade and you want to click exchange. So you probably recognize this bit where you're transferring BNB to any altcoin you like, whether that be uh, safe moon, whether that be yummy, uh, loads of coins just like that. Then the next step is go into the top right where it says connect. You want to simply click on connect and it's going to list all of the wallets you can go and connect it to. So if you say try and click on trust wallet, it's going to go and say no provider was found because this is when you're usually within the Trust Wallet app. So you want to go and click on connect and you want to go and click on wallet connect as you can see. That should be there. It's uh, at the minute it's two up from the bottom. So click on it and then you're going to get this pop up here. So you can use your QR code. I personally just click on mobile and then you want to go and click on trust. Then it's going to go and open up Trust Wallet and you're going to have this um, connection here. So all you want to do is if you agree to it, you go and click connect like so. And then as you can see, it says you can go back to your browser. Then you want to simply swipe back to your browser. And here we are. I've now connected my wallet to PancakeSwap. I can go and make a trade. So if I go and click select currency and search for say SafeMoon. So I'll just search SafeMoon as an example. There you go. I could then go and trade my remaining BNB for SafeMoon. Honestly, it's that easy. Then you go and click swap. Now you will need to readjust any settings you've made. So if you say click here and you need to have that 12% um, slip slip setting, as you can see, I would need to type that in there. Um, if you didn't know for some coins, it needs to be set at 12 to transfer. But yeah, guys, that's literally it. It's a lot easier than people think and you don't need to be moving your tokens to different wallets. Uh, Trust Wallet still works really, really well. So yeah, that is today's video. If you found it useful, please go down below, subscribe to the channel, leave a like for more. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.